Good job. You, it you could see it perfectly fine. Whatever was in there until he got in here and he just started stirring it with this. You get down. One hand here. One hand here. Yeah. Oh, don't jump on the end. Yeah, don't. Not right here. Right here. Okay? That's very important that you do that. Plus, you... the shingleless roof is probably going to cost $30,000. So don't walk around on the shingle. You got it? Arms up. Are you just gonna go down? Here, let me catch you. He got it. He just wanted first. Go yeah, for it. Do a flip. Go, go, go. Don't mess up the $1,200. Are we going off the box? Pass. The bug never did prime yesterday, so. That sucks. He's coming over hard. Come on, ladies. You'll feel it. <laughs> He's redheaded. He's a redhead. Skate into the deep end. Aaron, skate in. There we go. There you go. Skate into it. Do a ollie. Do a ollie. Uh, that was so weak. Alright, look at that eye. The gym is closed. Have no fear. Home gym is here. We're here at my dad's house. We're with Dillard. We're about to get some calisthenics in for shoulders. And then we're going to come here and do some bicep and triceps. Alright, D, let's go hit these shoulders. Work. We'll do four sets of five. Okay. You right here, I'm right here? Yeah. Try to get as many as you can in, okay? Yes, sir. How far do we go off? Just an arch in your body like this. Feet in. Difficult. Woo. All right, so we got two shoulder workouts in. We did four sets of 10 each set, and we're about to get some dips in right now. Thank you, Corona.
Push ups. <coughs> Just doing presses? Yeah. Do close grip if you can. There you go. That's what you're going to be doing, close grip. Down there. Um, hold on. All right, so I might have just hacked my camera. Um, I don't know just yet, but it's recording and it hasn't messed up, so I'm very super grateful for that. Um, real quick, <clears throat> um, let's talk about this virus thing going on. What is it? It's March. Yeah, March 20th, 441 p.m. 2020, which is 2020 for you future people. So, there is a crazy virus going around, and it's, I guess it's like a breathing, like a respiratory, your lungs, it's like the flu, and um, people are going crazy. I'm sure people, you guys have seen the news. Um, everywhere is out of toilet paper, bottled water, uh, bread. Like, you know, the, the essentials basically are all sold out. People are fighting over it. Um, they're not really fighting for it. There's like a few stuff online, you know, memes and stuff like that. You, you know what that is. Um, you know... People are freaking out, and um, I'm not really freaking out about it. Not because I'm like, you know, an old person who's got like a breathing problem or like, you know, taking it serious. But I don't know anybody who knows anybody that has it. And um, I think it's good to take, uh, you know, safety measures and whatnot. Um, so that people feel safe, but, um, you know, I got a life to live and one of my favorite things to do is work out. So, I mean, not, not that it's a big deal. The gym's closed for, I think two weeks, you know, what's two weeks gonna, it's, you know, there's talk about like, if you have it already, you won't know the Simpson symptoms like early on and blah, 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 blah. I just think that people who really worried about it should be you know they should be careful but the rest of us like I would like to be able to go to the gym um but you know we got home my dad's got a home gym you guys just seen in the workout video 
calisthenics and whatnot. You know, cool stuff like that. Um, we can still go to the park and play basketball. We can still live normal. It's just like, you know, it's just one of those things. Like, is it a conspiracy? Is it, is it real? Is it not? Is it because of the election that's coming up? Um, is it because the economy needs to like flush out some cash? Just crazy stuff. Not not that I care, but you know, you see stuff online and it's 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 whatever. <clears throat> I would just like to go to the gym. I just seen one of my neighbors. I live in an apartment complex, and I just seen one of my neighbors like walk up his stairs in his workout outfit with a towel around his neck, like he got done working out. I'm assuming. Like a lot of people around here, I'm assuming he goes to the base because the base is still open, the gym's still open, the basketball court's still open and whatnot. That's pretty cool. My roommate has a pass to the base. He's in he's in the army, so I'm sure one of these nights when he's not working, we can go up there. Nonetheless, if there's a will, there's a way, baby. We're gonna get it regardless. So um, it's a little chilly today. I think this whole video is from Sunday and will be posted on Saturday. So it's basically a week. Um, just a bunch of stuff has come up. Um, I just applied for heating and air apprenticeship. Yeah, HVAC apprentice is what I put down. But I doubt that I'll get that job. So what I'm going to do is find a temporary, 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 I can't say that, a temporary job. Um, during the day, I, I did have a job previously, um, but I was working evenings and I really like to have my evenings, you know, um, just cause I've got some things that I'd like to work on, like a side hustle and just a couple other things, you know, the, the masculinity, the spiritual masculinity stuff and. And uh, I would like to start teaching like Bible classes again, just to, you know, I don't know. I, I've got stuff I want to work on, you know, it's not like I'm just going to just be like wasting my time in the evenings, but I do want a day job just so that I can pay the bills. Um, the coronavirus thing is really like slowing down online sales. So I really this month I've only made like two sales. And uh, it, it was great returns, great returns. I turned $4 into like $115. I sold golf clubs. And I just got back from the UPS uh, place. And it was going to cost me over $100 to ship each one. So I kind of told the lady, like, yeah, this is crazy. I'm leaving. So what I'm going to do is wrap the golf clubs. Like the clubs, I'm going to wrap them in maybe like cardboard or foam or something. And then literally all I'm going to do is wrap it in a trash bag, tape the trash bag up, slap a, a label on that and just ship it off. Because I'm, I'm not paying over $100 to ship a golf club. That makes no sense. It's literally like less than two pounds. It's, that, that lady was smoking some dope. Um, but yeah, <clears throat> nothing too crazy. Um, just this past week, I got this beautiful cut, you know, it'll all be in the video. Um, I want to do, you know, more recent videos and whatnot. I do, like I've, you know, I've said like a million times, I do got video ideas. I'm not supposed to be touching my face, but I keep like touching my face. Corona. Corona 2020, baby. Um, but I think we're going to be good. I think a lot of people are freaking out over this whole thing. But if we can survive World War Three and uh all the other crazy stuff that 2020s brought like i i think we'll be okay uh there's just been a lot of panic you know um when it comes time to it we'll see who survives and who doesn't and uh, that's when we should all panic um we should definitely be safe now yeah but i don't think we should panic so the stock market is the Dow's going down. People are freaking out. Um, sports, everything's canceled. But um, we have hope, you know. Everything's going to be okay. Uh, I know I'm just blabbing away and whatnot. But this is like the recap of everything that's kind of been going on. Just some thoughts I want to get out. 
Um, ever since I got this cut, I have not played or played put on my uh, clay mask, but my skin's it's just oily, not too bad. We're gonna work on it. I just don't I just don't want to like irritate this thing on my face, but uh, it's healing up just fine. The scab is there. People are like oh, what get stitches? I'm like ah, I ain't got money for that. <laughs> ain't nobody got money for nothing. Um, so my uh, my overall goals is to sell everything I own except for the the bare essentials like you know my camera my laptop my bed um everything else can go yeah um I'm having financial problems for some reason I keep running into bad luck and I don't know if it's because of the virus or whatnot but um like I'm getting my stuff is getting paid for it's just like it's taking extra time I, I I'm just I, I I don't get it it's like it kind of stresses me out but it's like it gets like itself taken care of you know but it's like my taxes came in my bank rejected them then I had to wait a check and then they took a bunch of money out of my taxes for like for it bouncing and just it was really weird and the sales online have been really slow so it's like okay now we got to get a job um, which is not a problem. It's just like it just sucks that this is this scare is going on because it really does affect people and um, Which is you know, it is what it is. So <clears throat> That's one of the goals is to, is to get a job Be more consistent with the uploads um, You know we got a bunch of other small goals. I have the whiteboard behind the camera and just like filled with stuff, but Priorities priorities so yeah i guess with that being said guys i do have a podcast out um if i remember i will link it below it is terrible super terrible i've got two mics i, I hooked this mic up and it's it andrew was speaking into it but it sounded like he was like across the room speaking into it just it was just terrible but nonetheless we uploaded it we had fun doing it we plan on doing it every sunday it's called the mason nation podcast name due to change i don't i don't know if it'll if that'll stick or not we want to do something do something different i don't know we'll figure it out um nonetheless we're gonna watch v for vendetta is that what it's called v for vendetta i'm gonna watch that tonight um and find a job i've been applying a bunch of places hopefully this you know hopefully someone picks up but um yeah everyone stay positive stay in there um keep grinding if you are the kind of person who made it this far i really appreciate you it's so crazy um i hope you do well and become successful in life um and in successful i mean happy happiness is successful because we're not promised tomorrow um yeah so if real quick if you're the person who's like lazy and unmotivated quit being a little loser and get off your ass and go conquer the world and be your own boss and be a badass and i say that with love um you can do it anybody can do it um i'm working on it it's it just depends on how bad you want it, you know. Yeah, I guess that's it. I'm going to cut it off there. It's almost at like 12 minutes. So, oh, this clip. Anyway, Godspeed, God bless, stay woke, fam. Peace.